At Esports Driven, we strongly believe that Fade is the best initiator to play on Pearl. In today's video, we'll show you every lineup you need to dominate the map on attack and defense. Let's get right into it. First, let's take a look at the A defense lineups. To take super early A info, come against the barrier and aim at the bottom corner of this pillar. Jump and throw at the exact moment to make it work. It'll scan anyone here. Very reliable information. But if you prefer using your haunt to fight, use this lineup. Stand at the back wall of back sight against this door and look at this corner at the top left of the arch. Enemies from A main and sight will be revealed. Easy kills for you. Let's now cover an easy retake eye. Come in A link and walk against this corner. Aim at the bottom edge of this tile and jump throw. It will scan enemies playing post plant from A main and on the site, just like this. Taking mid control is super important, and this lineup will make it much easier. Stand in this corner in B link and aim at this small line on the roof, right under the cable. A simple throw will make the eye land appear, revealing anyone in the B shop area. Very nice lineup. Defending B on Pearl is difficult with this super long line of sight. We recommend you use this lineup. Stand in front of this corner in B heaven and look up until you reach the little ledge on this tower right here. The Fade Haunt will land on top of this tree and scan the entire path. Except for enemies behind this pillar. You will get scans anyway. Then to retake B we strongly believe that this lineup is the best. Come into this corner and aim just like I do. Run and jump throw and the reveal will land on top of this roof, scanning many sight positions and long too. Your Nightfall ultimate is always a great tool to retake with. Once you regroup with your team on A, come in this spot and cast your fade ultimate. It will spot DK and deafen anyone playing on sight in A main. Extremely powerful for a successful A retake. On the B site, you should use it from heaven like this hitting every attacker on the site. You'll only need to focus on the main area. That's half the work done. Let's now cover the very best haunt lineups to attack the A site on Pearl. First, you need to clear the closed corners as defenders could be pushing here. Your prowlers will help you take up the space. Once that's done, come to the spot for the first A lineup and aim at the top of this shape on the dome. Run and jump throw and the eye will land exactly here, spotting anyone playing in dugout and back sight. It's super effective. You always need to switch up the lineups you're using, especially when attacking. To perform the second reveal, align yourself with this yellow line on the box and aim at the corner of this wall. Make a short running jump throw and it'll land all the way up on this roof, scanning every position on sight. You'll get scans every time you use it. Attacking mid enables a lot of different strategies on Pearl, so make sure to learn and use these lineups to take early control of the area. For B-Link control, come into this corner right against the barrier and aim at this line under the tiles. Make a jump throw and the eye will land on top of the chimney and scan all of these positions. Very nice information at the very start of the round. Defenders often like to take early fights into B main. That's why you should use your prowlers out of the B lobby. Make sure to run up against your allies to get rid of anyone playing aggressively here. Once that's done, quickly get in this corner and aim in the middle of these two tiles on the roof. This very quick and easy lineup will show you where the defenders are playing on site. The only dangerous positions they could be in is back halls, but your controller will easily smoke it and you'll have one prowler to clear it. No problem then. Attacking is made extremely easy thanks to Fate's ultimate ability. Just like when defending, we recommend you use it as soon as it's available to take contested space on the map. For example, when pushing A, your ultimate will cover the entire site, plus some of the defender's spawn territory. On B, you should use it just like so. Your enemies will fear you. You still need to learn the best fade lineups for the six other maps in Valorant's pool. That's why we've made an entire playlist to help you master fade to her maximum potential. Click on the screen right now. Thanks for watching, consider subscribing and leaving a like. We'll catch you in the next video.